idea to write this show as a middle school theater director for many years. As part of the audition process, I had the students fill out an information sheet so I would see if it would conflict with their after school activities. I was just amazed to see how busy they are. Do you have your audition sheet? Yes. You can relax, Sarah. Have fun with it. Okay, let's see. On Mondays, you have CCD from 3.15 to 4.30, mm -hmm. guitar at 4.45, mm -hmm. and tutor at 6 o'clock. Tuesdays, you have jazz dance until 4 and tap until 5. Wednesday, you have swimming until 6. Wednesday is totally out. Just like, let's look at Thursday. It says you have Hebrew school from... Didn't you say that you have CCD on Mondays? I'm both. I go, I go to both. I'm bi-religious. Well, according to this, you're only available to rehearse on Fridays. Friday for 15 minutes. Wow. Yet, yeah, they still want to take on another activity. Cheerleading. Violin. Travel soccer. Football practice. It feels very important for middle school especially to learn how to prioritize and have a commitment and really not spread themselves too thin. And that's just the nature and the theme of, of this show. It's funny how much the show related to my life. Like when the girl's schedule was, was getting read off by the teacher and she was going from soccer to gymnastics to CCD. Karate! And then she had a ton of homework when she got home. That's like exactly my life. And sometimes I think I'm gonna go crazy. Yeah, and I like this soda machine song too. Kick it! You wanna break it? No, maybe it's already broken. No! no! It can't be! That machine is our whole world! The soda machine is broken, and I ain't joking. And the soda machine is broken, it took my subway token. Now I have to walk, my mouth is dry as chalk. This sounds weird, but if I did the play, that would mean that I had time to do the play. I would be free. You're right, that does sound weird. I'm just kidding. You know, I quit the play too, before we even started. What? Why? Well, I had a full plate too. It was tough, but I thought I could juggle it all, but I just couldn't. But you know something? That's only for now, because things are gonna get better. All about the data. Definitely hysterical, but it had a great serious message behind it. Um, how busy kids are and overscheduled they are. And a few of the moms and I were talking, and we decided that we really needed to help our children prioritize better and pick what's more important to do. And I definitely think that school districts will benefit from seeing this show.